What if I told you I knew how to add trillions of dollars to the global economy and improve the lives of billions of people with a single policy change? Sound too good to be true? Well, I should warn you, it's a policy that people in most rich countries oppose. What is it? Open immigration. The consensus among economists is that free trade between countries creates huge gains in prosperity. The same thing happens when you have free trade in labor. In other words, more open immigration. We don't have to remove all of the barriers to immigration to start to see these gains. If only 5% of the population in poorer countries immigrated to richer countries, global incomes would rise by four to nine trillion dollars. These gains are possible because when you allow workers to move to countries with more economic opportunities, they are able to produce more wealth with the same skills by orders of magnitude. For instance, when an unskilled Haitian moves to the United States, their pay rises by more than 1,000%. Some worry that increased immigration would harm native-born workers. However, most studies show that on the whole, these harms are non-existent or minor, temporary, and clustered on only a small portion of the population. Free trade and labor brings economic gains to virtually everyone in the long run. There's plenty of room for debate about what a more open immigration policy should look like, but our goal should be clear to allow more workers to freely move around the world to where they can be as productive and